dear Madam President, just masters and guests. Uh, and thank you, dear Grammarian, for correcting my very mistakes. And thank you, dear Ahakaoka, for counting all my extra words. And uh, thank you, my evaluator, uh, for any feedback. Uh, it doesn't matter if it is positive or negative. Uh, because I think that uh, we should be grateful not only for good things in our life, but for any experience. Uh, even if it can, can hold it as negative. So, are there only good things in our life that we should be grateful for? Uh, you can find your own answer for this question. Uh, but I think it's not at all. So, uh, because uh, the unpleasant experience that I had in my life. Uh, helped me a lot. And I think our mistakes are our best teachers. And uh, I'm going to tell you the story to prove it. Uh, once I fell in love, it always happens unexpectedly. Uh, I saw him several times before, but then we just met occasionally at the metro station. Uh, I, but I don't believe it. It was just occasionally. Maybe a uh, it was just a grand, a great plan of the world. I don't believe it or not, but I think there is a special plan uh, for all of us uh, that we follow in any moment of time. Uh, but his plan was uh, to invite me to drink a cup of tea. So we uh, were chatting about uh, nothing, and uh, I can't tell you exactly why I liked him. Uh, he was very talkative, and with a great sense of humor. Uh, he was older, and uh, he had uh, enough experience of uh, young and girls. <laughs> but <laughs> I think maybe uh, the main reason why I fell in love was just because I wanted to love someone. So we started texting. He called me uh, a tigress and himself a tiger, because we were born in the year of a tiger. <laughs> So I was in love, but I was in great doubt about our relationship because he was quite different uh, from all other men that I met in my life. The other men uh, invited me to you know, some good cafes or restaurants, even if they don't be rich, and uh, they uh, called me, they uh, helped me, and they took me. Uh, back home, and they gave me presents and flowers, uh, as usual, yeah. so, and they didn't want something uh, more than things. Uh, at least they helped us, too. but uh, uh, he was quite the good uh, He didn't call a lot. Uh, uh, he, uh, he invited me only to some cheap cafes. Uh, in spite of having enough money, and uh, uh, he didn't help me, and he didn't get any presents for us. Uh, but he uh, demanded a lot. He wanted me uh, to look always ideal, to be extremely polite with him, and uh, to cook for him, uh, and uh, to help him too. Once he even asked me uh, to buy a ventilator for him, because he hadn't enough time. But there was also one more request that was even more irritating <coughs> at the previous one. It was uh, uh, it was his demand to tell me always thank you to him for every uh, small <coughs> step, for every small action. Uh, I think I'm quite polite, and I usually use some magic words as excuse me, good morning, uh, goodbye, and thank you. Uh, but I have forgotten about it several times when he was opening the door or he was taking my hair back. Uh, so, how angry he was, he told me, Oh, don't you forget anything? What about thank you? Oh, yeah, thank you, I replied. Uh, but um, it was quite difficult for me to understand why he's so principled in this matter. So, I was outraged with his behavior. Uh, you can ask me why I haven't abandoned uh, him 
Oh, I tried to do it several times. It was a difficult struggle between my mind and my feelings. So my feelings were stronger. And uh, he decided to do it himself in several months. Uh, it hurt me a lot, of course, but I think a lot of things that I should, uh, should tell him thank you for. Uh, because uh, this experience has changed me a lot. On the one hand, I became uh, more, more careful and more suspecting with men. But on the other hand, I became uh, more grateful. <coughs> Now appreciate people's help uh, uh, and support uh, much more than I have done it before. So I think I just uh, used to be uh, sometimes disgraceful, and uh, I just got used to attention like a celebrity, and I took it for granted. Uh, but now um, it's quite the opposite. Uh, now I appreciate. Uh, all sympathy, attention, and even uh, uh, just some small favor uh, that everybody have done for me. So, and I never forget to tell thank you. So, I would like to tell thank you today to everybody that helped me in my life. Uh, and I would like to tell thank you uh, uh, to my parents uh, who left me uh, when I was a child. Because it made me dependent and strong. And I would like to tell thank you to my classmates who used to tease me at school. Because it made me sympathetic to others distress. And I would like to tell thank you to anybody who helped me and it doesn't matter how to tell it. And I wish you to have only good things in your life uh, to tell thank you for. But uh, also if you have something uh, uh, that you would not like, I wish you always to be strong enough and uh, to be wise enough to be graceful. Thank you.